Hey everybody, it's Emily. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be planning for the week of October 7th through the 13th. And this was the week of Bennett's birthday, who is Andrea's son, and it was the week of his birthday party as well. So I wanted to use this kit in honor of him, and I did a mixed metals with silver, gold, and I did pull in like a little bit of red foil. Um, I actually used um, the chunky glitter header overlays that are mixed metal and then I put the red ones on top of them and then I used like the mixed metal bottom washi overlay for my bougie boxes I did like one silver one gold that kind of thing and then the to infinity and beyond quote box overlay is actually on one of the versions of Andrea's PR freebie so yeah that is kind of everything for the base I really like how this spread turned out. It's super cute. I did pull in the Once More With Love Toy Story sheet, and I think it turned out really cute. So getting into Monday, the first thing that I marked with a Once More With Love shark sticker is that I got my period again. Um, sorry if that's like TMI, but I was having some like not fun times with figuring out birth control and all of that kind of stuff. So I marked that and then for marking Duncan, because this is when I was getting Duncan every day, um, I used the coffee run script and for all of my scripts I tried, I did fail a couple times, but I tried to um, do like silver and then gold, you know, like go back and forth between the two. And then I did full orders this day, so I used a Kenzie's Creation script and my custom munchkin of me filling orders. And then with a once more with love, like a uh, little like emoji face, I just marked medical scare. I just was like really concerned and um, ended up, maybe I made like a doctor's appointment. I can't remember because like I vaguely remember this time, but this was a couple months ago and I have been planning some other spreads too, so I don't really know. But yeah, I also forgot to flip my planner to one side, so sorry. Um, then I did have Wendy's for lunch that day, and I marked that with a Wendy's script from SBC and a little fry doodle from the Red Wiggle. And then that night I went to the comedy show, and I did go to Voodoo Donuts afterwards, but I didn't have room to mark it. Excuse me. But I thought that Mr. Potato Head was kind of funny for the comedy show. I don't know, I just kind of like put random stickers everywhere. At this point, I was looking for a sticker that got lost so I didn't like pause filming or anything it should like be finished soon because I did speed this up um, but I did mark Duncan and then I'm going to mark filling orders the same way that I marked it on Monday except I used a quarter box instead of one of the squared boxes I used a lot of the squared boxes this week which I'm pretty hype about I like using those for like filling orders, different things like that, that kind of take up a big chunk of time and I have a script for and I have a character sticker for. I feel like I should have like edited this out. Are we back? Okay, we're back. What you doing, Emily? Okay, there we go. Cool. So yeah, I marked that I filled orders and then I did have therapy this day and I marked it with a once more with love munchkin and I wrote down that therapy was like really hard this day so I'm assuming that I probably did EMDR not really sure um, and then I did have Culver's I think I got it like on the way back to work and I marked that with a like icon from the wiggle I feel like this voiceover is just not going well I don't know why I'm like really warm right now and like studio lights I only have one of them on because the lighting in my room is really bad and I need it to like put any stickers down or like to do any of that and it's just like really really warm really toasty under here so yeah I marked Culver's then I marked that I was in my feelings with a once more with love um, <laughs> munchkin I am mixing up my words and I used it in my feelings script and then I did a cook dinner this night so I used a cook dinner custom from Kinsey's Creations and a once more with love munchkin and I think it looks really cute I was cooking dinner like quite often when I like lived in my apartment but the cooking dinner 
was mainly like making pierogies or mozzarella sticks. I did make like pizza a couple times where I like bought the crust, the sauce, and like actually like made it. But I mean, I technically considered it cooking for myself, even though it probably isn't considered cooking. I don't know. Then on Wednesday, I did sleep in, so I marked that with a little bow peep. And I marked Duncan underneath that with Jesse. Oh, that's so cute. The Jesse girl is on that day, too. That's really cute. I love, like, these boxes. Like, it was to where you could, um, I think it was, like, in the fam boxes, you could put the kids by each other's side, and it makes a double box. So I think that's really cute. And then I did fill orders this day. I think this was when we had, when I was filling the foil sale orders. Um, so it was quite a couple days of filling orders. And I used the same things for that. And then I did have one of my Emily dates at Chewy's, which Chewy sounds so good right now. I'm actually like pretty full right now, but I also feel like eating. I feel like a lot of us might be might be feeling like that. I feel like just when you get bored, you want to eat, or when you're, like, at home all day, you just, like, want to eat. I don't know. I was talking to my therapist about that today. Um, and then I also went to HEB that night, and I marked that with a grocery run script and a Once More With Love sticker. Moving on to the second half. This Thursday was Bennett's birthday, and I used a buzz for that, because if I remember correctly, that was his favorite... Um, character at the time and underneath that I marked a Duncan run with one of the little army guys which is so cute and then I did watch Toy Story 4 this day for the first time because I figured like I needed to watch it so I could like understand and I didn't want to feel like a poser for using a kit and using character stickers that are from that movie if I haven't seen it so I used a Forky because Forky made his debut in this movie and I used a Toy Story movie script, which is from one of the Disney, one of the Magic movie scripts. I'm not sure which one. And I pulled in a number four in gold from the number sheet in the shop, if it's still up. And I think it looks really cute. And then I did mark being on silhouettes that day with a Once More Love sticker, just plain on the page so that bougie could show. And then I did fill orders that day. So I marked that the same way I've been doing. I cooked dinner. I kind of like messed this up. Like, I don't know how I do this. Like I just get in, like in the zone and then I forget. And so I had to cut pieces from like the headers page to put over like the food little thing and the TV little thing because I put it on the wrong side. And the last time I tried to pull up a sticker like that, I broke a nail. So did that. The cooked dinner munchkin is from once more with love and then this day was actually national mental health awareness day and so i used a like um a ribbon sticker from once more with love and i really like those stickers because there's a lot of days and stuff um that i don't know how to mark something but i want to mark it and most of the time the ones that i don't know how to mark are like national blank day so I thought that one was perfect, and I obviously struggle with mental health, and um, it's a big part of my life, so I definitely wanted to make sure I marked that in. And then I did tidy up, so I used a munchkin for that. Then moving on to Friday, it was payday, but I did not mark that, just because I already know that it was payday. I used a coffee run script, and I don't honestly remember this dude's name. I'm sorry. Um, and I put the munchkin on the silhouette inside of one of the square boxes. I, like, put it in the middle just because I didn't have a script for it, so I just figured it looked cute there. I don't know. And then I did go to H-E-B this day. I kind of put things out of order, um, but that's okay. I marked H-E-B with a grocery run script and a like shopping cart from Once More With Love and then I did have Taco Bell so I had to mark that and I used a red foiled icon for that 
I am kind of getting ahead of myself over here. Here we go. Also, um, just because I've got like a little bit of a head, I am deciding I'm going to film the plan with me is like the back planning for these spreads that I only have the base down. The other ones I actually already finished. So there's still going to be a couple more. I think there's like maybe four more. One, two, three, four, five. Five more. And one of those is the week that I went to New York. So that's pretty exciting. Um, but yeah, I just figured those ones would make a good video for each one. And honestly, I was on FaceTime with Lawson and just started like planning. So, whoops. Um, I also had a nail appointment on Friday. So I marked that with an icon and the script. Then I took a bath and I marked that with a face mask munchkin. I think I've said this before. I don't have a lot of bath stickers. And the face mask is like me time. So I just figure like it makes sense. Um, and then I did cook dinner that night, so I used a munchkin and the cook dinner script from Kinsey's Creations. Saturday, I slept in, and I used the cutest little slinky dog sticker. So cute. And this is where I realized that I was going to mark that I took the day off, too. So there were two gold scripts right next to each other, and I was like, dang, okay. Um, but I marked that it was Bennett's birthday party with these little balloons from Once More Love, and the colors fit perfect. We did have pizza for lunch at the party. I think it was home slice, maybe? I think, maybe. I don't know, but it was good pizza. Pizza's always good. And then I did Visit Noelle this day, so I used an emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. and a Visit Noelle custom script. Then I marked that I did laundry with this Once More With Love like laundry line, which I think is really cute. And I like spreads like this because you can pull in like a ton of different colors. So a lot of those like random stickers and like the bright colors were able to match to this. I took another bath this day, so I marked that the same way I did on Friday. And I had Taco Bell and I used my taco foil doodle that was red already. So I used a heart one just because I love Taco Bell. So it made sense. Then on Sunday, I literally had four things to mark. Um, so, and one of them I put on a little thing because it was my coffee. So, yeah, I marked coffee run. And then I filled orders. I could have like broke up like filling and packing orders, but I mean, it's like the same thing kind of. So, I marked that with the Kinsey's Creation script and my custom. Munchkin, and then I was on Silhouettes, so I marked that with a flag, and I went to Hop Dottie for dinner. That was another place that I kind of did my Emily dates. Hop Dottie has the best burgers and really, really good chili cheese fries, and I used to live by one, so I was kind of going there on the weekends sometimes um, as like another Emily date, just because like I felt like it. I don't know. I don't really have a good excuse. Um, but that is everything for this spread. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love doing mixed metal spreads, but they do take a hot minute to do. So I kind of was like putting this one off for a second just because it was mixed metals, but I'm really glad that I finished it because it looks so cute. And I love what I did with the, the sidebar right there. But here is your wiggle. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.